Hey there, Kat Sandin here, Product Marketing Manager at AppFire. I'm thrilled to share that we've released a brand new, completely redesigned version of one of our most popular apps, Advanced Tables for Confluence. In this video, I'll show you some of the exciting changes we've made that'll make it easier than ever to build custom Confluence tables. Let's take a look. Advanced Tables for Confluence comes with four powerful macros that allow you to easily customize your tables to display all your most important data right within Confluence. The biggest change in version 8.0 of Advanced Tables is the brand new, more user-friendly macro editor. You'll notice right away that the look and feel of the editor has been completely transformed, as well as how settings are grouped and organized. So you'll just select the number of column styles your table needs, and then you can modify each column by adding a column style, column type, and total type. You can also preview your changes at any time by clicking the preview icon, or you can hide it for more space while you're editing. You can also add or remove column styles with a simple click. And if you need help with any of these formatting options, you can easily access our documentation by clicking one of the icons in the bottom left of the editor. The numbering and totaling section and the sorting section both have the same settings you're used to, but are now better organized and easier to work with. The row formatting section lets you choose how many alternating row styles you'd like to format in your table. For example, if you select two, then all the data rows in your table will alternate between two different styles. You can also define header and footer rows, and you can include styles for your header row. Again, all the same advanced settings you're used to are all still there and can be simply toggled on or off. If you want to edit settings for the entire table, you can add in some additional formatting, or you can modify advanced settings, like enabling the data to be downloaded as an attachment. Another big update in version 8.0 is the improved interface for pulling in data within the JSON, CSV, and attachment table macros. For example, when we're in the CSV macro editor, you'll notice a dropdown to select your data source. If we select attachment, new dynamic dropdowns will appear that make it really easy to locate the file we're looking for. And all the table formatting options are easily accessible in the left navigation so you can use the same intuitive editing experience to format and display your external data however you'd like. And there you have it. Building beautiful tables in Confluence just got a whole lot easier. If you already have advanced tables and would like to start using the new editing experience, simply upgrade to version 8.0. And if you're new to advanced tables, head over to the Atlassian Marketplace and start a free trial. Thanks for watching.